Tell us about the gifts of the Spirit and the benefits. For yeah. example, somebody is there right now that is having a growth in the head, mm. a lump in the head. You need, you, start, you need an operation to remove some growth in your head and inside your head and God, because it's causing headache. And, so that's a tragedy. But the, that's a gift of the Spirit that allows me to know that the person is having that problem. And when I pray right now, God is going to make that uh, lump or growth disappear or it's going to make that operation successful. So in the name of Jesus, we pray, pray for do supernatural mm -hmm. intervention. And that's why, that's a simple example of how and why gifts of the Spirit is, is necessary. And that is another person that is having problem in his thigh mm -hmm. or la lap uh, of the left, left leg. It's like, either I am seeing either you broke your leg or something, it's like the bone is broken or the muscles are uh, totally uh, weakened. So whatever that problem is in your left leg, God is healing you right now in Jesus' name. Another mm -hmm. person that is having stress, God is healing you as well and pressure be healed in Jesus' name. So mm -hmm. that's, that's just one of the manifestations of the gift of spirit. But it doesn't have to be healing alone. You have gifts of spirit that has to do with prophecy, word of wisdom, word of knowledge. You have word of, uh, gifts of spirit that has to do with faith, uh, healing, and you know, the power of God mm -hmm. and you know uh, other things that God does supernaturally because we're all limited because of our limitedness as human we need God's intervention sometimes that's why we need the gifts of the Holy Spirit. Wow, amen.